Okay, you're in Word and you want to prevent a table from splitting across pages. You might want to do this for a particular row. You can see here the row splits across the page, or you might want to do it for the table in general. So I'll show you both methods. Let's start with the row that is splitting across pages. So what you want to do is to right click in that row and go to Table Properties. And on the Row tab, you need to untick this option, allow row to break across pages. You also need to go to the table tab and make sure that text wrapping is set as none. If it's set as a round, this method won't work. So make sure that's set as none, click on OK, and you can see that that row no longer splits across the pages. OK, let's move on to the second scenario where we want to prevent a table from splitting across pages at all. So here I have a table that's split across two pages. To prevent it from splitting across the pages, this is what you do. You need to select the table, and then you can either go up to Paragraph here, or on the Home tab of your ribbon, go to the Paragraph Launcher here. Now you need to be on the Line and Page Breaks tab. By default, you'll probably end up on this tab. So go to Line and Page Breaks and tick this option, Keep with Next, and then click on OK. Now, if it still doesn't work, what you need to do is select the table again and go to the Properties button, or you can right click in your table and go to Table Properties. Go to the Table tab and make sure None is selected under the Text Wrapping setting. If a round is selected, it's causing the problem, so select None, click on OK, and you'll see the table is no longer split across two pages. OK, that's all I wanted to cover in this particular video. Hopefully that's useful. If it is, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll see you next video.